Hello and welcome to Ultra Modded Skyrim, everyone. We here at Sixth House Gaming hope you're all having a wonderful day. This is the Licentia mod list for Wabajack. And figuring in the 20 or 30 mods I have added to it, the total plug-in amount is sitting at exactly 1,307. Nearly everything in the game has been overhauled, added to, or streamlined, and there are a bunch of new creatures, weapons, armor, locations, and NPCs. This is going to be exciting. We can't wait to get started on this epic journey, and we're super excited to have you all along for the ride. Our heroine in this story is Talari. Talari is the descendant of generations of Morag Tong assassins. In fact, her grandfather's claim to fame was that he worked alongside the Nereverine in the Balmora Guildhouse back on Fardenfell. Her father was just an infant during the Red Year, and her family fled to Mournhold. Then, just a year later, they fled again to Blacklight when the Argonians invaded Morrowind. Talari herself was born in Comaris, just outside of Blacklight. And just before she came of age, Talari was assaulted and raped by a nobleman. Her father took revenge on the nobleman, but he did not count on just how powerful their new enemies were. Talari's entire family were slaughtered in retaliation, and she fled her home. She knew that her powerful enemies would pursue her relentlessly. So, she booked passage on a ship headed for Solstheim, hoping that the far-flung outpost would be the last place her pursuers would look for her. Unfortunately, though, as the ship neared the small island, it was attacked by pirates, and Talari was knocked unconscious in the battle. All right, and here we go, everybody. We've chosen our attack to Left 4 Dead start. Uh, we will be a Mafala worshipper, like all good Dunmer Morag Tong assassins are. All right, and there's our ship, attacked by pirates, knocked overboard, knocked unconscious, washed up here on this little island. Survival mode is off for the moment because if we were to go into that water with survival mode on, we would not make it to shore. We would die first. So that will be turned back on once we make it across. Anyway, here it goes. Make sure there's nothing down here that wants to eat me. Okay, good. Okay. Looks like we have some wolves over here. And yes, I know, you're seeing the adept, uh, adept difficulty and you're thinking, oh, come on, crank it up. You haven't seen this mod list yet. It's pretty brutal. It really is. Uh, Bleak Falls Barrow, I was doing testing before I started this run. And, uh, you know where you, uh, you free the guy from the... the spider webs and he runs off into that chamber with three draugr in it well that chamber had like eight draugr in it oh nice 
Yeah, like eight Draugr. One of them shot lightning out of his hands. It was <laughs> pretty terrifying. <laughs> Piggies. What is that? Oh, a blue conch. I don't remember what the color of the conch was in uh, Lord of the Flies, but I have the conch. <clears throat> Don't mind me, piggies. Now I have a weapon. Which is good. I wonder if there's anything up here. There's a fire over there. Some people. Oh, shoot. I forgot. like a freight train. Get lots of foliage mods, they said. It'll be great, they said. <laughs> there she is. Okay, and I am almost at my carry weight limit already. Good times. Damp Hall Iron Mine. I don't think I will. Not at this point. I know there were some people going up this way. I don't know if they were friendlies or not. Oh, shoot. Yeah, they are not friendlies. See how many there were. At least two more.
three of them left. Holy cow. That's what that was. Yeah, I'm gonna get you and your buddies. Your armor will look good on you. I'm not wearing any. Alright, I'm not putting on any of this armor because, uh, jar of pearls, well, that's kind of neat, purple torch, man, weighs 20. <sighs> uh, because you, uh, you wouldn't be able to put on somebody else's armor in real life. Without having it fitted first. So. In order to wear anything that she picks up, she's going to have to uh, visit a blacksmith. Oh my gosh. She's super cold. See if we can warm up next to this fire. If not, we may have to go into that mine. I just saw wolves over there. Alright, I am chilly. 
if there's anybody here or if they are friendly or hostile so I'm not going to take chances be a perfect place for bandits though so somebody. Yeah, there's people there. Let's continue on. Let's see. What is this up here? Civilization, yay! All right. So now it is time to take everything these people own. Owned. You know, past tense. Now those look cool. Not to worry, you're you're gonna see me overloaded quite a bit in this playthrough, but uh, I will, whenever I'm overloaded and heading to town to sell stuff off, I will speed things up. So it won't be so long and tedious to watch. And I will also, when I'm reading a book, I will uh, leave the pages on the screen just long enough for you to pause to read if you 
feel like reading them. Is that another one? Looks like another one right here. Oh, another body. Hungry, overloaded, tired, but we are still alive. I think we're going to end this here. We will see you next time. Hope you all have a wonderful day.